Oh, this your phone going on. Hit about that much. Hit on the side like that. Now go like that. See? Just like that. You think you can do that? You want to try it? Here you go. I'm going to move the bowl over for you. So you can be closer to it. Let me show you again. You want to use this side of the spatula. So you use it like that. And you stick it on the side. Smooth it out. And that doesn't have to be perfect because once we get all the icing on the side, we'll scrape it and make it all smooth. Yep, just like that. more getting it I'm okay, gonna put some more right up in here yep there you go Good job. You're doing better than some of the people I watch. <laughs> this is all you. Should we take a good bit on top? Like that? Yeah, we're going to lie on top. Because we're going to scrape some of it down. So we do that and then we take it. I'm going to teach you how to roll out some fondant to do that top part. And then while this sits, we're going to do the little bags of flour and cookies and rolling pan and stuff like that. Yay. I appreciate you so much, Miss Lauren. I appreciate you. I appreciate you so much. Because my good want to bake bake. I said next year she's going to make everybody in the family a birthday cake. Well, she'll be able to. Okay, you ready to scrape it? This is what I use. It's a paint scraper. Okay. It's the best thing you can use because it's flat. Mm -hmm. So what you do is you want this to be flat on your board and you want that to be flat up against your cake. So you take it and you turn it with your turntable. Just like that. And then you scrape it. You want to try? Mm -hmm. I'm left handed. I forget it. There you go. You got it. You keep going. You got it. You got it. Keep it firm board. Look at you. Okay, I'm going to do it again. Keep it on the board. You ready? There we go. A little bit at a time. You did it. Are you ready to do the top? Okay, what we're gonna do on top is you take it, you see your lowest point like right there, and you pull. Are you gonna try that? And you pull to the middle. Okay. Yeah. Then you scrape it, then you turn it, and you go again. Yep. <laughs> this takes muscle. Are you going to start squeezing on it and just mixing it up? Squeeze down or just squeeze it on hand? Yep, you put it up with your hands. Is it hard? There, there you go. go. What color do you want to put on top of your cake? Hmm. Violet. Violet? Okay.
Next one, dude. You said. I always take it, dip it in there so it's not too much, and fold it into the fondant so it doesn't really get on your hands. You know, keep folding it into each other. Every time I go to see color, I fold it in. That way nothing gets on your hand. And normally I have gloves, but I forgot to bring the gloves. Okay, there you go. Now you gotta keep mixing. Keep on mixing. So a little food stuff. coloring go a long way. It does. Just a very little bit. Mm -hmm. And there's some colors that will get lighter, and there's some colors that will get darker. darker. Like red will get darker. Mm -hmm. Blue gets darker. Uh, black gets darker. But um, like pink, pink stays the same. Teal stays the same. Yellow stays the same. And so does green. But some colors do get darker. Okay. Pick it up and rotate it. Nope. Okay. Well, I think you got to. <laughs> the most. some cupcake toppers too out of your uh, cookie cutters that yep it will okay then we're gonna move this out the way and bring your cake back over here move it out the side see that how it took the uh, wrinkles away doing is when you do this you're pushing your icing up so whenever you go to scrape the top again you'll have to get all that extra icing off you're gonna try to rub it see how it feels like just rub it up and down yeah you're good you're gonna get a hang of this fast she gonna wanna bake every day, Ms. Lonetel. Mm -hmm. That's good. I do the cooking and she can do the baking. We bake some cookies or little cupcakes or something. You know what I did for my daughter is get the um, pillow mm -hmm. Yeah, like I said, we put a lot of icing on top because we take it a lot off. off. Right, y'all are taking a lot off. We take a lot off the top. Edge. Okay, you ready? Smoothing it down on the edges. 
You look good. What we did. To make sure all the layers are even. We roll it. And then we take the injector knife. There you go. And we cut it into four slices. We got one. See, I just did it myself. Okay, and then you want to curl that, you want to roll those into balls. What And that's your first layer of your cake. I see they had a color in between. Let me see. What color icing do you want on your cake? The small one? On your small one, on this one. Um, we have purple. Looks like it's really thin. Can you just go ahead and cut them? Mm -hmm. Yep. Like that and then we cut. Can I try it quick? Can I try? You wanna try? Careful with that part, okay? Don't get close to that. There you go. There you go. Just turn hard. There you go. Oh, that's fine. We're, they're coming all sizes and shapes. Okay. So, perfect. You wanna put it down? Okay, we're gonna do the same thing like we did the bowl of eggs. A little scissors. Yeah, we'll turn the uh, this little bit of pink into purple. Take it, squeeze, and just go completely around. Mm -hmm. It's called a rosette. It looks like a little flower. Mm -hmm. You want to try it now? Yeah. Push it down, squeeze it here. Put your hand around the bag like that. Yeah. I'm left handed. You're probably right handed, aren't you? Yeah. Okay, so let's see. Squeeze this part. On the top. You want to go. There you go. Well, I you it. did a flower. Okay, and what we'll do is so you can hold it. Just like that. I have been if you put purple and pink on top. Purple and pink on top, and you'll see. Okay. Like pink on top. Yeah, I need a lot of paper towels when you're a baker, too. Oh, yeah. I just was watching a video on Facebook. She did the same thing I did with the paper towels. Smoothed her cake out. Yeah, we use them to smooth them out. We use them to sit cakes on. Yeah, she uses it to transfer the, another cake on top of it. Yeah, the paper yeah. towels. This is how I'm gonna show you how to do cakes. I mean, on borders. We're gonna use paper towels. And what we do first is, and you drag it. Yeah, you gonna try it? You gotta squeeze hard. Just like that. Okay, and what you always do is you always start in the back. Push this back. And put it, push it up with it. It takes a lot of muscle to do these bags. Okay. Here you go. Start on there. Like this. Mm-hmm. Like this. Yeah, but you want to do this, let me show you. Let me show you on cake. Okay. 
Did I? Yeah. Now I'll help you. Yeah. Squeeze, squeeze hard. Let me hold your hand while you do it. There we go. You see how hard you gotta squeeze? See, you're doing good. All I'm doing is squeezing. You're the one making the, uh... there you go. You can get done. <laughs> and look, the pink's starting to come out. So with you, you should be getting pink. And just keep on going around and around. Okay, now how about flowers? You wanna learn how to do a flower? Mm -hmm. Let me see that bag. Got one more bag? Yeah. Yeah, because if you see how it has that little cut in it, it's two points on it. If you take it like this, where the point's sideways, this it makes a leaf. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna Okay, so but if you do it bigger, Squeeze and let it pull. Squeeze and pull. You just keep going all the way around. Do you also do it in the middle? Mm hmm. Watch. I'm going to show you. Okay, once you do that, you go in between mm -hmm. each one. You see? Mm hmm. And you kind of build it up. So nice. If it was red, it would like a poinsettia. Okay, you ready to try? Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna show you what we do for the middle. For the middle, we're gonna take this color, since that's what we got already mixed up. Okay, go. I like a flower, actually. You like the flowers better? Okay, you ready to do your own? Okay. Like they, ooh, they look like a leaf for real. I couldn't tell in the other view. Yeah, twist, twist, twist. Yeah, okay. twist it tight. You mean hold? You mean squeeze your hand with me? Help you. Okay. Get the bag turned a little bit. You're getting it. Okay, let's adjust your bag. Give some more icing down there. Okay, you got to put your hand on it. I'm put my hand on top of yours, okay? your bag again. There you go. Now 
Okay, you ready for your middle part? Mm -hmm. Here you go. You can do this one. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. I can do like a swirl. You can do a swirl. Is that what you want to do? Beautiful. Period. Look at you. Yeah, this is the end of the video. She gave her a recipe book and look how she wrote some tips and little quotes in there. We are so grateful for her being able to come here and teach my daughter. But at the end, I'm going to just post some of her cakes. She bakes her cake from scratch and she decorated. So, yeah, enjoy.